Welcome to the Echocardiography Online Simulator MyEchocardiography.com Select the patient Choose the Echocardiography view Left parasternal view, long axis of the heart Short axis at the level of the aortic valve Short axis at the level of the papillary muscles Apical four chamber view Subcostal view of the inferior vena cava Let's find an apical four-chamber view with a 3D transducer. Using appropriate slider choose transparency level. Place the probe at the point of apex beat, usually fifth intercostal space, near anterior axillary line, probe marker directed right side. Probe angled up along the axis of the heart, more or less towards the patient's head. Simulation of the color Doppler examination Simulation of the one-dimensional examination One-dimensional examination of the mitral valve One-dimensional examination of the aortic valve Any time user can freeze the video and examine frame by frame. Let's perform linear measurements of the heart structures. Let's perform volumetric measurements of the heart structures. Using the simulator user can perform all types of measurements and calculations recommended by the American Society of the Echocardiography. Let's examine left ventricle ejection fraction. User can use the single plane or biplane method for calculation. After freezing the image we can find the best frame of the end systolic phase and trace the inner wall of the endocardium to measure the end systolic volume. Let's measure end diastolic volume. The simulator will calculate left ventricular ejection fraction and stroke volume. Let's move to pulsed wave spectral Doppler. Pulsed wave Doppler of the transmitral diastolic flow. Continuous wave spectral Doppler. Continuous wave Doppler of the transmitral diastolic flow. Tracing the spectrogram user can perform all general spectral Doppler measurements. As we can see on color Doppler the patient has mitral regurgitation. Using echocardiography calculators let's assess severity of the regurgitation by area of the jet.
the patient has mild mitral regurgitation. Let's examine flow in the ascending aorta. Pulse wave Doppler. Continuous wave Doppler. The patient has aortic regurgitation as well. Let's assess the severity of the regurgitation by pressure half time, PHT. The patient has moderate aortic regurgitation. Echocardiography online simulator myechocardiography.com